grab your virtual popcorn because we're going to be talking about the history of VTubers here, specifically the first ever VTuber. But before I go into the history of VTubers, I should probably explain what a VTuber is. You see, I am a VTuber. Right now, this character would be considered a VTuber. The term VTuber is the combination of the word virtual and the word YouTuber. Because believe it or not, I am actually not a purple-haired vampire. I'm just a normal guy talking in my kitchen with a webcam into a microphone. But what you're seeing is a character that tracks my movement. Fascinating technology, isn't it? Now that we've got that established, let's talk about the first ever VTuber. That YouTuber is known as Amy Yamato, who posted her very first video on May 18th, 2011. Now, Amy is a 3D animated character who vlogs about her experiences in London, and she does so by blending the real world with scenery with her animated persona. And you might be shocked to find out that the first VTuber was in fact not an anime character. Shocking, I know. In fact, her design is a lot more early Pixar than it is anime, and I think that's actually pretty interesting. But if we wanted to talk about where the term VTuber came from and how the anime phenomenon of it all started, we have to talk about Kazuna AI. And in her very first video, she created the term virtual YouTuber. And it was this 2D anime character and her bubbly personality that really made VTubers who they are today. Almost overnight, she was made famous, and for good reason. I mean, even by today's standards, her model and her anime character looks fantastic. And although both of these creators have had quite a downfall from their peak, they still to this day get a good amount of traction. And if you want to check them out, I will have their information in the about section down below. But yeah, that's the video short and sweet. If you enjoyed it, let me know in the comment section down below. I just wanted to make this video because surprisingly there just wasn't like a good video on this yet. Nobody had taken the time to talk about the origin of VTubers, despite the fact that there are so many VTubers online, 